I don't know. I don't know. This is why I guess they've curtained off the rest of the building. What? We were the? here yesterday and they had boards set up with barbed wire and everything. Are they, he, he, You saw him mention something about insurance. Did he Did he call the building and get this show canceled? Did he fault out on insurance? What? We're having a tournament tonight that isn't a deathmatch tournament. Yes, I'm I being... find it strange I didn't see one single gimmick coming into the building, so... And I didn't see any of the guys. I thought they were just all preparing somewhere else. I don't... Apparently, they've been locked out of the building. They were here yesterday. We were all here yesterday. Everything was getting set up. Something has happened in between last night at 9 o'clock and oh. right now. Hold, hold on. I'm getting... <laughs> of course, yeah, you want this put up. All right. <sighs> oh, my... F we we had something set up. Wait, is this? Did you? Do you think this is what he was saying? Remember, he told, remember he said Richard taking Yoshi's spot. Yep. And then and then he was talking about invitations. He mentioned something about he pre-planned this. He was talking about shit. this on Wednesday. God he's had it. a week to set this shut up, and a week. I'm. I assume he's had more than that. I. That's what we know of. Now looking back at it, Wednesday he was talking about sending out invitations. Well, I guess we know what the fuck he means by that. He's hijacked the show. The base cooey. No more deplorables. Take away deplorable Christmas. Well, we have the brackets here in front of us. I, I guess. Got a fucking bracket too. Like, <laughs> so he has time for graphics. He has time yeah. for brackets, and I'm guessing fucking, what the uh, wing looks like. But he, video, like he, the video. He, but he's not gonna let the the extreme boys know that they don't have to come to the arena. He he wants that shot of them all locked out of the arena. Come on. <laughs> I can't. I I think I understand how this is gonna go. I yep. I'm being I am being given a piece of paper right now. It's been walked to me. Thank you, Co. This is going to be under round wrestling in rounds. Ten five minute rounds. It's a little bit old school, a little bit uh, English, but I guess we're gonna be seeing. <laughs> I guess we're gonna see a lot of grappling here. I, if I if I had to guess, knockout rules in effect. They're gonna have after a, after a, a knockdown. The ref is gonna deem whether the 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 wrestler can can continue on. They're gonna be forced back. The standing wrestler is gonna be forced back to take a corner, a neutral corner, and wait for ten. I this is the weirdest. This, this, I've never called this, anything like this. Just MMA, classic talent. Yeah, I we're gonna have to figure out what the hell we got to do something about the thrash. There's got to be a backup. I don't fucking know. But we we got the first match coming up now. Dave Karolinko. <laughs> taking on Hanzo Mon, and I guess Hanzo Mon uh, shedding the... I, th it really feels like this is going to be a shooter's tournament. If I had my money on it, I think we're going to see some some uh, punches <laughs> in punches and uh, some submission wrestling, especially from Karolinko. Hanzo Mon, I don't really know of him as a, as a shooter, personally, but clearly he has some sort of form of training. You know what? Actually, now that I think about it, a little bit of Muay Thai, a little bit of kickboxing and Muay Thai training. I don't know how... Fresh, he's, he's, you know, brushed up on, but he's got Karolinko. We know Karolinko's a legitimate grappler. We know he's a shooter. I gotta go with Karolinko on this one, Ledger. I don't know what to, I don't know what to think about this. We gotta do our jobs, big dog. Remember, it's all about being professional. So, I am going to be completely professional and go, just look at Hanzo on for a second. Uh, no, 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 no. We can't be going to HR. Is HR even here tonight? I have no idea, but I am I mean, for Shooter Hanzo Mon. 100% in. Well, She's really giving him full contact with her eyes right now. So. <laughs> Do you know who you got? Uh, I mean, it might be the spiffy new look, but I'm going to go with Hanzo Mon on this one. I mean, Karolanko, he wears that to train in. Uh, Hanzo Mon, though, <laughs> where have you been hiding that thing there, buddy? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Nexus, you going with the grappling prowess of Dave Karolinko? You going with the striker in Hanzo Mon? Hmm. What? Sorry. Oh my that's god! I'm saying it. Oh. I'm saying it. It's there. This is uh, there. Every this is weird. every this cloud has a silver lining, big dog, and this one is a far more scantily clad ninja than he used to be. Yeah. 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 Um, let's uh, let's yeah. boink. Uh, I mean, Hanzo. You, did Hanzo. you say? There, I said it. Uh, no, I didn't say boink. No. I said bulge. What's what's on your mind, cowboy? All right. Bulge. All right. We are telling them to send them out here for the first first match and part of the first round of the Tournament of Steel. Hmm. Don't oh, sound right. 
it's there. I guess uh, we got a tournament, guys. Please stick in here. We're gonna try to figure out what the hell's gonna go on with. Hey, look, a lot of our guy, a lot of our roster is on this show. We should. I mean, everybody got swerved. We still gotta support Dave. We gotta support Hanzo and the rest. And there are the fight for the fifth tonight. THC yeah, th those challenging have to happen, right? Those have yes. to Did they know about this? Well, they must have. Fuck if I know. Powder man. cake challenging Shogun. We still gotta support a dub three. Uh, all right. Okay. Well, at, at least something's normal. He's got the wrist tape and he's checking it. Oh, look at look at that ring. Oh. And blue. I'm gonna no tell you this. this that's gonna that takes a long time. Yeah. That takes a long time. He had that specially ordered. He's been playing yeah, this shit for a while. Order and then get the, the, the time um, the, the craftsmanship that he made, and then shipping. Do you, do you does anyone have binoculars? God damn it. I can see just fine. <laughs> especially the book. Guys, get your fight. We're about to see some, I guess, fighting. We're about to see something. <laughs> All right, as you see, round one in the corner there. What do we got here? Now feeling out process. I, it, these guys haven't wrestled each other in, in this sort of setting. You're wondering how this affects everything. I'm circling some strikes there. Beautiful takedown by Karolinko. Sticking and moving as Hanzo Mon lays in a punch knee right to the midsection. Whoa! Missed a kick, but he car wheeled out of it. Now trapping him. Go far, I'm stretching him out with those legs. Ooh. Watch the shot. He's on that left, that left cross. Whoa! Open up with him, drops him to the floor. Beautiful leg trip there, classic wrestling there. Shot, that's not anything classic wrestling. These guys are not pulling their punches in the slightest. Went for a takedown there. I think that's one of the reasons why they were chosen for this very fucking surprised. Oh, tournament. caught him with that kick. Shot there. Leg sweep again. Hanzo quickly to his feet, scrambling to his feet. Karolinko playing very far back. Assume he's going to pick and choose when he wants to shoot in. Missing those punches. Take down there. What's he got planned here? Hanzo again. Going to a submission hold. Now they are testing each other's steel. Uh, back and forth. I can't believe I just said that. Take down once again to a side headlock. You're seeing a lot of grappling here by Karolinko. He's trying to force him into a corner. But Hanzo trying to escape from the side there. Rolling ankle lock. He's got that locked in. Back and Kick forth. Back. Oh. Nice shooting from behind. Picks Ooh. up the leg. Stands at a standstill. Ooh, working kick to the, the head. Kick. Now working over the legs. Did you hear the slap of the meat? All right, first round is done. I, I This is such a weird format to go through right now. You got to have Karolinko up on Hanzo Mon. The grappling really coming through. Legend? Yeah. I, I'm not going to be much good in this one, Big Dog. This is not my style to comment on, but I'll say both of them are definitely... I see why Talon invited them. They to have a very natural um, progression in this sort of style. I get it. I get why he wanted them. I, uh, you have to assume this tournament is just a big scouting. I don't, I don't know what this tournament is. Uh, one man's ego. Well, they're, they're signaling us to get back to the ring right now. Let's go. That sh that arm whip into the headlock once again. That side headlock uppercut there by Karolinko. Shot there. And now punches and bunches in the back of the head. Karolinko covering up. That'll end a fight quick. You know, Legend mentioned scouting. Uh, I'd say so. Hanzo did beat Richard Burkowski last Wednesday. Yes. And That's oh, true. Dave's, been, Dave's also been on Talon's watch list lately. So he's having both these guys go at it. Dave uh, critical Richard. Richard. Yeah, I'm beginning oh, to see a trend oh, here. Uh, oh, 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 he's got a chokehold there. Reverse triangle. The arm out of the socket. And it's definitely showing. Oh! Oh, 
right there. I was going to say Hanzoban, definitely known for the striking game. Well, Look at that. Go Beautiful. Mission, but now Hanzo showing that he is into the mixed caliber of martial arts. Yeah, so you're seeing a lot of submission uh, work here by... by Hanzo Mon, I don't think I was expecting that. I thought he was going to be uh, more with the kicks and the knees. Is this what he trains in when he trains Muay Thai? I, I think so, but he looks like he's got a little Brazilian jiu-jitsu in there, too. I have to take up Muay Thai, like obviously. <laughs> Lash suplex beautifully executed. Now Hanzo on the back pedal. Take down nice there. Shooting. Oh, series of kicks. And he's got a calf slicer there that he needs to get the hell out of that one. As he does, he just twists it his way out. Oh my god! Kick lands! Is this going to be it? No. He's to his feet, and he is good to go by the uh, standing count of five there. Kick to the midsection. Round two is almost coming to an end here. Ooh, beautiful transition! That thing's working over the face and almost the, the rib area. He left. It's in for a strike exchange, but the bell rings. Bell rings sounding the end to the second round. And I'm going to give this one to Hanzo. Hanzo uh, really came out, shown that he has a little bit of grappling uh, uh, tutelage as well. Impressive arm bar escapes and locking them in on several occasions. This is, uh, this is definitely... It's definitely interesting. Uh, it, we're getting time between. I'm not used to this. I'm not used to having this extra time between rounds. But we're seeing uh, as as it stands right now, uh, two rounds down. We're one and one, as far as I'm concerned. All right, let's head to the ring for the third round. These guys are ready. Shot there, blocked it. Ooh, eats two elbows there. Beautiful leg sweep. But he keeps getting caught. I don't know how much is there on, on the torque of that hold, but he's able to keep Karolinko from him. Oh my god, alligator choke there. No. It was a reverse anaconda vice in a sense. He oh. keeps... I think he's really using that as, as, as a way to keep Karolinko away from him. Leg sweep there. Again, he can't get past that. He leaves himself open way too much for that strike. Now turned over. Again into that rolling clutch. The head and arm choke there. Oh! Roll right into the arm bar. Is Karolinko going to tap out? He's holding his He's arms He's not moving. There. Oh, is this... His arm's kind of hanging low. His arm's hanging low. Yeah, the stand Ooh, is beautiful. definitely getting more exhausted. He tries to go in for that suplex, and now working over the ground and pound, hitting the lefts and rights to him, but not enough to get a submission or a ref stoppage. Knee lift. Whoa! X into the crowd. Gets in with a go behind, oh, taking the arm. He's worked really that arm for a while now. No, he's right back on top of him. Rolling ankle lock, and he is putting some work in on that. Able to go away. Oh, side headlock applied there. No rope breaks in this, clearly. Both of these men almost sliding out of the ring. Oh, my God. Oh. He went out after him. I don't think you can do that. <laughs> well, they did it, Big Dog. Anything's possible on this whatever the fuck to oh, We're thing. all adapting oh. on the fly. Oh, question oh, mark kick. kick. Oh, my God. Two. He's going to get saved Three. by the bell here. Oh, oh my oh. God. <laughs> I wasn't even looking. Good call. He might have just got saved there. Just a perfectly placed kick by Hanzo took him out of it. Again, I think Hanzo's going to be up 2-1 to one here as we safe. head into round 4. Uh, I'm very surprised at what we're seeing from Hanzo. Dino, he, I was not expecting the the submission capabilities. I don't think anybody oh, really is. But th then yeah. again, Hanzo is not really known for those submissions, so it doesn't mean that he doesn't train with them. He just needs to bring them out when they're needed. And honestly, I'm pretty damn surprised by it. What the hell else is that man hiding in there? Oh, man. In his, in his repertoire. All right. Fourth round coming up in the first round of this Tournament of Steel. Oh, right to the arm. Oh, Focusing in on it. Oh, He's God. literally trying to reach for those ropes, but was nowhere near it. 
Oh, see, oh, I nice think crack. Hanzo is starting oh, to go for those kicks. He's got an E-bar. He's got an E-bar. He's starting to throw these kicks because he knows that he can't defend himself as well. Oh, no. Kick to the back of the head. Oh, my God. Barrage of kicks landing heavy. Karolinko struggling to make it to his feet. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Beautiful transition. Hanzo right there on top of it. Look at this. Oh, my God. This is wrestling purely right here. Oh, my. <laughs> no. Not like this. Yeah, yeah like that. Oh, my I God. <laughs> this They're is... going back and forth, just interlocking and interchanging. There is some major. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. God. I've never seen anything like this. Fight oh, forever. Yeah. <laughs> and they're trying to pin each other down with each attempt. You notice Erlenko going for the arm on Hanzo. Hanzo and just goes out and finds a way. This is pure wrestling in his purest sense. You gotta be getting some kind of knee burn on the mat, I'd think. Oh, dude, they, yeah, they are peeling back to the bone at this point. God damn it. You see, you see Dick? Taking a breather there. Good for you, Mr. Dick. Oh my god, this is awesome indeed. The stamina of these two individuals. <laughs> one of them I mean, could break it anyway. That's for a reason. It's gonna be That's the first one to make a mistake. <laughs> this is this is wrestling. <laughs> Alright. And, and I think we have reached the point of panic. In that last round, they are starting to get desperate. They know that they're closing in at the halfway point and furthermore to the 10th round and decided that they just needed to try and ground each other and hit either a, a, a mounted strike or a submission. Uh, that was pretty damn... That was like watching water just flush back I, and forth. I think it shows, too. Like, we might be biased, but obviously trying to be in Talon's favor and wanting to uh, get his approval, maybe by having a good showing in this and not giving up. I get it. I get it. I don't like that, the guy, that but I was, would rather have him... That <laughs> round was pretty even as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> All right. They are ready for the fifth what round. Let's go. Idea, big dog. Now, now on the back pedal is Hanzo. See, so got planned here. Punches in the back of the head, trying to end this one in the beginning moments of this fifth round. Beautiful takedown there, picking him up. Shooting right back down. Got that rolling ankle lock once again, and he is putting torque on that left ankle, excuse me, right ankle of Hanzo. Leg trip there. Open palm strikes. Hanzo on the receiving end of a flurry of offense. Missing two there. Oh, fuck. Shot. Armbar. Oh, 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 and an arm. Give up. Juju Gatami is trying to break him through, but he breaks free. Oh. oh, oh, oh that my God. He's got a cravat locked in on that. Beautiful leg. Take down. What is this? Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> He's right back up. Oh, oh, my God. God. oh my God. God. An equalizer. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Oh, oh he is split oh open. Oh, he oh, oh, oh my god. Well, I guess we get blood after all. Hanzo Mon. Split Dave's face open with that kick. In the fifth round. Yo, I like this ninja. Silver linings. All right. I mean. He's still got a job to do. Inverted nice. Was See, a, there are still some things. A little bit of capoeira. That is incredible what a display from Hans Oman I didn't know that he had that in him but that kick put Karolinko out obviously Dick Patty O'Malley was not gonna let Karolinko continue he was off out on his feet as Hans Oman is I guys I can't I can't do you need some water it's, I it's weird water. no 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 no. The, <laughs> the reason that i'm having trouble is i was prepared for a deathmatch tournament but now we've got you say it when you got blood at least right? we've got quite the tournament on our hands we have a i guess a shoot fight tournament almost like a uh, a uh, a <laughs> fight for everyone <laughs> you know brawl for all oh <laughs> oh 
Oh, hopefully not. <laughs> My God, I mean, I wonder. It's, I think the next next match is Brukowski and Mac Tucker. That's, that's like. going to be an interesting uh, meet up yeah. there. Carolina. One I'm Linko. surprised by, the other one I'm not surprised by. Take a guess. Well, I, I from my detective skills, my great detective skills, I'm assuming that was supposed to be Yoshiyasu Hatayama. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And and, uh, and Brick being sent to replace him. Or Brick, sorry. Richard. Richard, yeah. Richard. Because uh, Yoshi picked a fight with Sumo Joe. Yeah, you don't do that. You don't. Yeah, it's all, it what? all makes sense. He's what an interesting week for the tradition. Now clearly everything paid off. Let's be real. And this being the first of the tradition matches, actually, Kyle says he's like they he's hold a station outside of their locker room. I guess to like a walkout. They, I, I'm surprised they allow Kyle back there. I'm going to be great completely honest. Through. All right. Yeah. All right. Ooh, we're, we're let's do a let's head back there. Walkout. Okay. Cool. They just oh. kidnapped Brokowski. Oh. They straight up kidnapped what? Brokowski. What? I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't see it. I, I mean, I, I guess Kim got invited to uh, the tournament instead. Uh, yeah. Kim Kim Chief oh, hold being up, hold given up. a I golden got, I just ticket. got an up, updated bracket. So, like, see? He was Kim on Chief the bracket. Tucker, all I mean, right. fine. Oh, man. <laughs> Funny how that happened. That's weird, right? <laughs> Completely strange. We got a second match here. Kim Chi versus Mac Ducker. Tucker, uh, just an all-out brawler. This guy has thrown hands in every state in America and beat the shit out of Slip that one time. It was great. But now he's in there with, 
I get he was preparing for Richard Burkowski. He's getting a whole other animal here <laughs> in the head of the Chi Dynasty, Kim Chi. To be fair, it might be more in Trucker's odds for it not to be Brick, who's always had his number in the past. Yeah, you're right. Uh, if you you know recall back in the Road Rage Tim Kurds days. Uh, not to say that Kim would be easier. I'm just saying he Brick has his number or Richard. Whatever. I don't care. Kim Chi is in this tournament, and now you have my attention, sir. All right. I don't know which way to. F I mean, I, I I want Kim Chi to win so bad. Well, the guys are out to ruin Talon's plans, and I am here for it. Are we ready to get into the second match of the night, guys? Yeah, sure. Yeah. All right. Let's head on. Mac Tucker and Kim Chi in the first round. Of the Tournament of Steel. What the hell? <laughs> this is such a weird... This is such a weird... Hap like, we gotta have a thrash, right? There has to be a thrash. We can't... This can't be it. Let's, the right. first, let's, focus, let's focus on what's happening. Yeah. Let's just focus on what's happening. Because you keep thinking about it. It's gonna eat away at you. Yeah. And, I mean, Let's You're focus again. on the Chi Dynasty ruining Talon's plans. Yes, exactly. I like and Hanzelman. Yes. What? I said and Hanzelman. <laughs> now this, I can get behind this, guys. Okay. This is a great payback if, if I, I know. <sighs> I don't know if this is my pick. I, it's if I were a betting man, ah oh, fuck. Uh, it's got to be your Rocky, right? Smart bet is your Rocky. I don't know. I want this guy. This is who I want. Chad, if you're wondering where all that power comes from and Kim's kicks, <laughs> it's those thighs. It's so all right, we're gonna see Swing quite a bit of striking cats. again. <laughs> Tucker not necessarily known as a. Oh my God! Did he get his forearm up to block that? Kim is already coming out here with kicks and bunches. Oh my God! Tucker trying to stay on top of him. What does he got here? Oh, shot right to the back of the face. <laughs> Didn't even that was possible. Wait, what? Now throwing hands. One got through there, rocked Kim. Second one, he parried. Ooh! We're starting to see that ball, that ballroom brawling that, that Tucker has really made a name for himself uh, all around the world. <laughs> around the world, around the world. Around the world. Around, that's later, fight for the fifth time, big dog. Shot, two shots of the gut after a, a knee by Kim. She, good God, he is throwing them in succession. Dino, uh, maybe this is the tournament for Tuck. I'm saying. Shot there to the midsection. Again, right across. Oh. Now just repeated left hands there. Oh, jeez. I was going to say, it's nice to see Mac wearing a new shirt, too. I know that's not what this is about, but having known Mac for a very long time... Uh, he only has one shirt, and now he has two. So I'm pretty happy about that. Oh my god! What is this? What has he got planned? Oh, and beautiful oh, suplex! God damn. Ow. Ow! Tucker didn't have a fucking choice in the matter. <laughs> Sometimes, just let Jesus take the wheel, big dog. <laughs> or Jesus, yeah, there's, in this instance. There's... Oh! Jesus oh, Christ. <laughs> oh. Oh, I get it. Oh, 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 possibly oh, just saved. Save the by the way. Bell rung. All right, we are not giving these. Oh, 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 that eye starting to close up, and he is doing the same. Look at those shots. That one got through. Oh, Jesus Christ. I can feel Oh, my God. Kim oh, is God. opened. Oh, right to the midsection. He's in the air out of him. Trying to finish this fight. Kim back on his feet, but he is taking heavy I damage. Pushing. 
Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Shit. That last one caught him right behind the ear. Tuck is up quick though. That one just rocked him. He is bleeding a lot. I don't know how long that that's gonna. Oh! <laughs> Knee to the face. I think he actually got him in the chest. That might have saved him. Slipped through. Single leg Boston Crab. You don't see that every day. I think he's just going for a hold and trying to bend him in half. Oh my god! Oh, fuck. He's down. This could be it right here. This could be the end of the match right here. No. See, if I were in cheese, well, foot wrappings and wearing white shorts like that, if I took a shot in the stomach like that from Tucker, I'd be oh. shitting my britches. Oh. Much like he's just eating his teeth this after that pick. Hit that yeah, landed point. center. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nine. Damn. Oh. Oh. Kim G advances. Caught him right. Or left. Round. I don't know which one it was, actually. Into the second round. Kim G advances, and you know Talon, who was just the happiest <laughs> man on the planet. Well, Wait, he said. Wow, a hundred. 100%. He said if he gets past this one, don't let him go any further. Into the second yeah. round goes Kim Chi. Whew. I mean, it did seem kind of a little weird they went right into that second round. You think Talon is up to some shit here? Or? Oh, no, not Talon. Up to oh, shit. You know, someone who who uh, who has has uh, whatever you do you mean? Pretty taken much taken an entire deathmatch tournament <laughs> and turned it into a shooto. No, he would have. Of course, he wouldn't want Kim to have a breather. Come on. I don't know, but I'm saying trust in like was Bree ever done, led you astray? No, no. She's probably Bree back Kurt there right now trying to get everything. Booker of the year. She'll fix this she's probably, if if, she's if, probably if, if it's fixable. Stuff. She will fix it. But anyway, uh, we do have updated brackets. As you see right there, um, Kim Chi <laughs> finding himself a golden ticket to this tournament. And, uh, and capitalizing on it into the second round, as well as Hanzo Mon on the other side of the bracket. I believe we have Shizuka and Dojo coming up. Now, you saw Shizuka earlier getting ready when Brakowski uh, mysteriously left. I guess <laughs> uh, he must have got cold feet. I think he got lost. <laughs> he was never the smartest. No, uh, He's very pretty. I, the, the, the world's eyes, the W3 fandom's eyes, are on... This right here, Hikaru Shizuoka, the first of the tradition, one of two now. I guess they were going to try to stack the deck with three competitors. That's not the case anymore. Dojo has a chance for an upset, and I think that this would be an upset. Um, Dino, you know, we know that Dojo is a very well-traveled and, and uh, well-trained individual in judo in particular. Also, those kicks... This isn't going to be a walk in the park for Shizuoka. He's giving up about, mm, what, 75 pounds? And that starts to matter in these kinds of fights. When I say that, I mean I mean fights. This is going to be a knockout, dragout fight. Who do you got, Dino? Well, as of this moment, and by the uh, well change in attitude that everybody has to have for these events tonight, uh, I'm going to root for Dojo on this one. Uh... The power is there, especially within the uh, weight advantage, I feel. But those kicks, man, we are literally going to see two different types of machine go at it. And uh, Sh Shizoku, Shizoka, he is in very, a very, very dangerous spot here. Dojo is not one to fuck around. And, I mean, even though this is a fight, he can still bust out that sick, disgusting, that chrome-caving brain buster on him in that ring that I'm sure has no give in it no. whatsoever. So, <laughs> I'm, sure. I'm not giggling to hope to see that happen. I'm just giggling because I'm ticklish. So, Nexus carried away in on this match. Well, this, yeah, this, yeah I yeah. guess this fight. Yeah, just, you know, go Dojo. There's a <laughs> tradition member on the other side of this fight, and uh, yep. uh -huh. they suck. So, go Dojo. Mm-hmm. All right, we are all squared away for our third first round match here as Hikaru Shizuoka and Dojo face off in first round action, the Tournament of Steel. Let's head to the ring.
Hikaru Shizuka looking ready for this one here tonight. This is his bread and butter, but Dojo could cap off an upset here and eliminate one member of the tradition in what is the tradition's own tournament. Let's be real. This is this is tailor-made for, for talent and his boys. Tournament of Steel. Well, he had three of them entered. Two of them. <laughs> Two of them made it to the ring. Well, hold on. <laughs> Sounds That's like the over. start of a joke. Yeah, Dojo! Or, well, you know, a night of my college years. That, that kid was here for a deathmatch tournament. Just let that... I mean, I will say this. The crowd looks very happy. They seem to be entertained. They're seeing some some great matches, some fighting here tonight, some catches, catch can, and some striking. Beautifully done here. Fight. Shot there to the midsection. Two knees repeatedly. Again, going to the work on the midsection of Dojo. That is five knees unanswered. Woo! -hoo 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 -hoo. Answers with a fucking beautiful hip toss there. What does he got planned here? Oh my god! Oh, oh, oh! Fuck. Dojo in trouble. Yeah, grabbing a front face lock and then just kneeing him in the mush. Series of kicks, but he answers with that elbow that caught him and it backed him up. Beautiful leg trip by Shizuka here. Oh my god! Oh, holy fucking shit! Oh my god! Oh, wait! <laughs> no, we need to end this now! Um, what? How? We need to end this now! What the what fuck? The fuck? Uh, uh, don't let him walk on it! Gosh, oh my you... god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! He tried to get up and fight, but that was it! Oh my god! I don't know what. I. That was a. That was a. Flash victory he, there like, by Shizuka. I don't know. I think uh, I think Dojo. I think up? Dojo was trying to get up and he and he possibly couldn't. This is not good. Yeah, I seen that before. Yeah. Uh, the first thing you do when your knee pops out, honestly, is to try and stand on it and see if it's okay. Yeah, you <laughs> so go into shock. Is yeah. What it fucking is. Plus that adrenaline and everything else. Ah, I can oh, still see it. Gross. Right oh, no, 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 no. Stop yeah, letting I, it. I, he knew. I really hope, but he had a heel hook on, and I know the one thing that a heel hook can do is blow out an Achilles, and if that happens, Shizuka might have just completely wreck dojo's career i really hope that that's not Jesus. the case let's not speak that into it i really hope that that's not the case let's get him to popo oh wait popo is locked, He's locked outside out. oh of the arena. shit frank there has to be a doctor there's no way the insurance even the altered insurance would let us have a show without a doctor on site right oh right? my god right? <laughs> Is that right. that's the second round for for Kim Chi? So we know what he's going to try to do, as you see right there. Well, talent said, don't let them advance. Kim Chi in the second round. This isn't good, guys. All right. Well, we're trying to get the next match out here, but well, you know that what it is. There's only one left. Uh, Yuraki and Fez. I I can't stop thinking about uh about Dojo. That's not good. That's not good. This is the finals of the first round here. Um, Fez, you, you're going to see these suplexes on display. That's going to happen. Yuraki's going to have to eat some of those. That's just how Fez is going to wrestle this match. It's gonna have, it's, hey, he's going to fight every single step of the way for those suplexes. He's going to try to drop Yuraki on top of his head. Yuraki is a, dra a jack of all trades when it comes to submission wrestling as well as his striking. He's just as dangerous as in the striking game that uh, spinning back heel kick Fez has to watch out for that especially the way that Fez comes in low and tries to go for a shoot in he can get caught with that heel kick and that could be the second critical of the night very very easily uh, Nexus I'm going to go to you on this one if I had to pick somebody to put money on and, and throw away my morals Yuraki's the guy I have winning this tournament I think it's fair to say. Um, yeah, there's. No, I, I I don't I don't like the tradition guys. I might like Joe a little bit, but I can't deny your Rocky. I can't deny that the man has a submission victory, although in a tag match, it still meant a lot against our world champion executioner. 
Yuraki is incredibly dangerous. I was hoping I was not going to see him here tonight. The fact that he's coming up against Fez here, like you said, is going to try and throw him around. But if Fez lets Yuraki grab one of those limbs, and with Yuraki, let's be honest, any limb will do, he's going to try and pop that limb out of a socket, just like we just saw with Shizoka. Yuraki is coming in here with the exact same game plan that Shizoka did. Yeah. Hurt your opponent, move on. And I hope... Fez can stop that from happening. Oh, I mean, I, I again, I, I don't want to see anyone get hurt. But if 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 I were to see someone get a uh, get nice and 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 beat up and bruised up, even in a victory, Fez, come on, do it, man, do it, <laughs> fuck, please, and do it. All right, we are set for the last of the first round. You're Rocky and Fez in this tournament of steel. He put his name in the tournament, guys. Of course he did. Of course he did. Yeah. This shouldn't surprise. I'm not. The more I think about it, the more I'm not surprised. Donning the red tonight. Maybe trying to. Uh, to intimidate some opponents, maybe making a uh, Fez see red here. He's gonna maybe try to catch him with some knees or some kicks coming in as he's gonna try to shoot in for those grapples. It's what Fez does. So, Yuraki knows that. He's a smart competitor. He's one of the most uh, decorated competitors here in Dub 3. He knows this. Come on, Fez. Please. You just came off an impressive victory choking out Radiator. I think he's feeling high going into the match tonight, and I hope he chokes out Yuraki. That'd be that'd be pretty damn sweet. Wouldn't that be fun to see? That'd be amazing to see anyone tap out Yuraki. Well, I mean, in, in this sort of scenario, Nexus, anything's really possible here. Bye. Here we go. Leading that palm strike out, he's going to see if he can keep him, uh, keep him at a distance. Just don't know how well that's going to work with Fez. Uh, this is kind of where his, uh, his, his height helps him here. He's going to be able to drop down underneath really quickly. Beautiful Whoa. suplex immediately. The distance game is definitely in Yuraki's favor. If, if Fez gets in close, he catches you and throws you. As you see him right now. Do it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Almost a uh, reverse Kimura there. <laughs> the only way to stop it is to tie him up in knots. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, oh my god! Oh. Right into the Chevelle lock! Oh. God damn this kid. God. He's terrifying. He's so good. Oh. Nice, nice capture into the cross arm. And you know, if I can wax poetic for a second, when when Yuraki first started in this mm. company, he started in red red gear. This so uh, this night tonight, this this tournament of steel is a oh, yeah, stop that. tailor made for him oh, and Sh oh, no. Shizoka. This could be like his rebirth, his restart, wearing what he yeah. what what he wore when he first started here. He shot in uh, there, Yuraki, quick enough to take that back step. Oh, bulldog choke! That's oh. locked in deep. No. Uh, Fez. You know, Fez doesn't have a neck, so yeah, it's, it's, it's going to be hard to keep that on him. That's where Radiator went wrong. Yeah. Where's your throat? Yeah. Just sh palm strikes to the face. Both men dropping there. Ooh! See, he he got those straight shots off a a, a jab and then a uh, straight through with the right. He got those landed underneath him. He's got to close in. Oh my god, he almost caught that kick shooting in. Leg trip there. What does he got played here? Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> and in everything. Holy oh, fuck. Oh shit, that was just the first round. <laughs> I know, right? On to the second round. I, I gotta say, I don't know. I, Yuraki probably controlled most of that match, but Fez ended that, that first round strong. <gasps> oh, and he is starting strong. Yuraki backing off. That shook Backing away. I, I, I feel weird seeing that. Mm. What a nice spin around there by Fez. And now what is getting this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh! Good lord. He's back on his feet, though. Oh, and a calf slicer. Oh, that God. is locked in deep. Oh, he's slicing the fuck out of that calf because he is constricting. 
Kick to the top of the head. Yuraki up, got kicked again. Fez playing from underneath. Another takedown. And Yuraki just flows right into that Chevelle lock. That It is his bread and butter. That's his that's his big go-to. Oh my god, did you see the leg trip? And now the oh. uppercuts from the side. Fez back on his feet and he's throwing. Missing that spinning back fist. Shots there. He's keeping he again using the distance there, keeping uh keeping him at this bay with the uh with the straight right hand. Beautiful transition by Fez. Elbows to the back of the head. I guess those are legal here tonight. Ooh! He is oh. throwing him around another! What'd you fucking expect? It's Fez! Oh my god, he is absolutely on a warpath! Your oh, Rocky is in trouble! Ooh, is he's Dick gonna step in? in? Oh. Is he powering? Back and forth, he's with those slowly backing Fizz. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh my god! To fuck this slipping shit! Oh my god. <laughs> Would it, wouldn't it be something to see? Ooh! Yuraki out the first round, guillotine choke attempt, no! <gasps> oh, Into the oh, armor, oh, no! Oh, God. Escaping danger there from that cross arm breaker. Third round in, beautiful oh, suplex! Oh, my, oh God. my God! He's hurt. I think Yuraki's hurt. Good, good. Oh my God. God, he is throwing him. No, Yuraki right back to his feet. Kind of rolled through on that one, I think. Oh my Oh, I thought he was setting up for a suplex. <gasps> God, I'm a man! This mission blocked in! No! Calf slicer again. He's going back to the leg. Much like we saw Shizuoka in the match earlier. Take Dojo's leg out of commission. Oh, oh he's going for the suplex, but you see him sinking in and again. His mission locked in. Picking him up to send him back down. Oh, oh my god. Holy shit. He caught him. Fez back Four. into it. Oh. Now feeling that he can go for these bigger strikes. But Fez still pushing. Oh, liver shots. Oh, speaking. Oh, oh my now god. Over the ribs with those knees. He's covering his head and trying to get his elbow down there to block those knees. But it wasn't working. Oh, he just dropped him. Now looking to lay in something. No, go. Oh, oh he's got a reverse triangle choke. Trying to, he's got that foot. His way towards the road. Okay, I don't think he got it locked in fully. I thought he got his foot. <gasps> oh, behind Fizz. Oh my oh god! My god! The I transition. My, I can't even keep up. The, my reactions just. Ugh. God, you're on. Fizz again with another. Bone rattling throw there, but Yuraki is sidestepping these attempts. Great. Great defense play by Yuraki. Oh! oh Fez! Oh. No! Fez! You gotta get on! Oh my god. Yeah. I'm fucking tired, mate! Fucking like robot! <laughs> god damn! Oh, Again! Oh my god. Oh. The bell saved Fez on that one. I'm sorry. It's getting, yeah. it's looking dim for him. Yeah. It's not dim, dim, but it's looking oh. rather gloomy. There we go. <gasps> Roll through into a knee bar. Oh, that was gorgeous. Fez backing off. Okay, now you're starting to see. Oh, as I say that, he transitions. What does he got planned here? Yeah. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Your Rocky's up. That was a Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. His head hit the turnbuckle. He, he's not getting up. He's not getting up. Oh my god, your Rocky's gonna be out. Your Rocky. <laughs> now four and arms across the face. In those forearm shots, trying to finish off. Your Rocky. Bulldog now choke. Rocky got to pop his head off. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> he's transitioning. No, your Rocky there. No leg sweep. Shots in the back of the head. You are seeing some wrestling purity here tonight at the Tournament of Steel. I can't lie. This is pretty great now. The fist raining down on Fez. There's nothing wrong with the tournament tonight except that no one knew. I'm enjoying my <gasps> Oh, my God. Fez Vision locked in. He's the fucking Fez Vision. No, you're Rocky holding on. 
<laughs> this round four has been Fez. Whoa! <laughs> Holy shit! It's been all Fez. He is in trouble. trouble. Get him, Fez. Oh Can he finish? Oh, 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 my oh, my oh, my oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! He's not gonna make it. He's not gonna make it. Please, 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 please. Oh my god! Fez just put out your Rocky. Let's go! Oh my god! <gasps> this night is great. You guys. Oh my! <laughs> the plan backfiring tenfold. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my God! Thanks for looking Ooh, up, ladies and gentlemen. With this type of style, when the when the cards are dealt. I mean, it doesn't even matter if you're from Eastern Penn. It doesn't matter if you're from Dead or Alive. It doesn't matter where the hell you're from. The better man is the better man. And in that fight, <laughs> the fourth round, four minutes, 28 seconds, Fizz was the fucking better man, mate. I need a beer, too, after that one. My God. Oh. <laughs> I I'm, can't believe your Rockies out in the first round. I am thrilled. <laughs> But well, we second, still do you? have the fight for the fifth. Yes, we do. It is it is that old Clark versus Pajaro, I think, that we're going to see, right? No, are you sure it's not the Turk? I'm, I've been I'm thrown off sure completely. Turk, Turk beat Pajaro. Shit, you're right. He did. I've been I, thrown off yes. completely by everything the Talons pulled here tonight. <laughs> we, I'm just excited to see Pajaro. I guess Pajaro. I need to put a towel under the door. <laughs> That are you to blame for our confusion? <laughs> Very bad. I'm not saying wah, wah, anything. Wah. When oh. you, where did that trumpet come from? It just kind of happens. What trumpet? The trumpet. The trumpet. <laughs> so like, are these matches like really death matches or something? Because like they're really, really hitting each other kind of harshly. Like it doesn't seem like it's friendly competition. I mean, I don't think I've there's anything in, friendly about that. No, you're right. I've been in mean boy competitions and I've won them, but like we are we are we bending the rules here? You don't have I mean, to worry. All all you have to do is win this match and you'll be in the top five. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. If you want, you to don't have to worry chair, about what anyone else is doing. If you want to call for a chair, Thad, I'll be ready. And okay. But, like, I should wrestle, because if I sit down, he's going to beat me. He's got a point. <laughs> he's got a point, Nexus. Well, I don't know what you're thinking. Oh, my God. Uh, that whole Clark and Prince Baharo, is this the first singles meeting between these two? Yes. I, yes. This is going <laughs> to... I thought I was thinking out loud for a second. <laughs> oh, my God, Thad. you got to wrestle here soon. Why are you... Up? Yeah. Do you have your boots on? Oh, you do have your boots he on. He doesn't. No, he's got his boots on. He's just got his kick pads kick pulled up. Pad, dude. I, I don't, you want me to wear my docks? I'll wear my docks. That's no, 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 no. you got to no, match, please, Thad. You take oh. this seriously? Talon's in a pissy mood right now. Thad, they're, 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 they're calling you. They're calling you. You're the music's off. gonna play. So seriously. <laughs> I know. Fuck. I'll meet you out back. Later. This is this is your oh, shot for fight right for the This is your shot for the fight for the fifth. This is this match is gonna fuck. By the way. Oh, 100 uh, That whole Clark and Prince Paharo coming up right now. I. Paharo's in trouble, but I I want to see him defend here. I like Paharo a lot, but he's that, already oh, getting was, ready. We should. We should go. Yeah. We should go right now. He's standing at the curtain. Yeah, your junior going. heavyweight fight for the fifth. That whole Clark. And Prince Baharo. Oh, that's me. <laughs> no, you're Thad Holt Clark. <laughs> Stop confusing so him. I feel so bad. Bad. Stop confusing him. Just let him. He hears his music. He knows. He knows what to do. I think. <laughs> Crowd firmly behind THC tonight, as we should all be. Wow. Whoa, what did you guys do to the ring? It looks different. <laughs> <laughs> that that smoke from the stage, by the way. Don't blame me for that. Strange <laughs> goddamn character. I like this. Is this kind of Is that a trumpet? 
the Ooh, trumpet. Okay. Prince Bahar representing that purple stuff here tonight. The trumpet at, made famous by Texas was, Blue Vega. was supposed, of course. Also German. Much like what? a Shut Munich. Up. Blue Vega? Shut up. Get out. Get out. house. <laughs> Here we go. We are underway with our first non-tournament match here in the uh, junior heavyweight five for the fifth. But they're throwing some kicks like the uh, like the tournament. <laughs> yeah, I feel pretty bad for them. That ring does not look like your standard wrestling ring, and so ah, oh, anytime they land on it, I am feeling a little extra bone crunching. Oh, what does he have planned here? Oh, the Already. <laughs> And another one on the floor, just in case. We are already hot and heavy out here. These guys have a lot to prove. That whole Clark in particular, trying to get into that fifth ranked spot. Baharo defending it for everything he is worth. Oh, He's wow. got a microphone. Oh, God. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> into the corner. What is that? Hold have planned here. Oh, no. Here you go, bud. Here you go. Oh, chair. Oh. Oh my god, that oh, is yeah. 24 by 24. Oh, That's a long way! Oh, right to the face! Holy shit! Tournament of steel chair right to the face <laughs> of Prince Baharo. Coasty coast. Shot there, leg drop to the back of the head. Caught the leg, beautiful dragon screw leg whip by Thad Holt Clark. It's not very often that Thad Holt Clark is the uh, slower participant in a match. Prince Baharo, the Prince of Swifts. <laughs> Oh, the kick to the back of the head, though. They'll make him forget a few numbers. They'll Landed take head scissors flip. Landing on Unreal. his feet. Missed the kick Ooh. there. Ooh, didn't miss that one. Oh, oh. Hey, <laughs> THC. THC. <laughs> Pajaro a little... Looking a little shaky there. Now I'm trying to get back. Oh, beautiful Lamai Stock Cradle. Great ring positioning to get away from the ropes there. Irish whip. No. Off into the rope. You got him with Shoulder that tackle. Soul Sp butt. Spinning soul butt now. Uh, that on the, uh, on the retreat, but then caught him right with that spinning kick. Educated footsies. Not enough for the three count. Robin Charleston getting his first action today. Woo! Yeah, oh, nice oh, pop two, up. No. Two count only. Body slam to the outside. Is he gonna oh, take flight? Same goddamn character. No, he's not. Landed on the microphone on the way out too. That probably didn't feel too great. I think he just bumped his head on it again. <laughs> How oh, heavy is that thing? I don't know. Come on. Great. Two. No. Shot to the midsection. Beautiful pinning combination by Prince Baharo. Try to save that fifth spot. Under the ropes. Ooh, ducked it. Oh! Oh, <laughs> Interesting little maneuver there. High right in the middle of the O of tournament. Of. Oh, boy, it's there the dead center of the of. Yep. Oh, oh to the outside. Oh, is he going to take off? Yes, he is. What are we going to see? Oh. He's got a baseball. He's got a baseball bat. <laughs> THC, right? Cleansing the timeline. I, that fucking dive was insane. <laughs> Beautiful leg sweep. Is it enough? Did he catch him off guard? No. He definitely would have caught us off guard with that if he caught a three. One, two. No. Oh. Stop that kicking attempt. Oh, as it did. Come on, that. A blunt object, Eddie Green. Oh, beautiful victory roll. Hurricane Rana almost getting the three two. count. That to his feet. Oh, oh. Big oh. kick. <laughs> My name is THC. <laughs> no, you can't no. do it. <laughs> yes. oh. Oh. Come on. Everyone knows that. that. Oh. Both men down here. Sandy Moonsold, and it's gorgeous. Is it enough to get the win? No, it is oh. not two oh. point. Oh. Oh, shit. Damn it, Thad. Go up. 
It's in off the road. Oh! Oh! Gorgeous spinning <laughs> kick on that Take one. Take his fucking head off. off. Into the corner. What is oh, this? Shit. Springy thingy. Oh! <laughs> to the fucking floor! Oh my god! Pat, are you okay? Bahara was going off. I guess I, he must be probably a little feeling a little silly about not performing well. Besto on the outside! After getting shit faced on his birthday before a match. Oh, getting fist faced. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! No! Oh, leg drop! Shades of David. Oh, is this enough? Is this enough? It is! Oh my god! Oh, main goddamn character! You did it, Fed! I did, huh? You're in the top five, bud! Wow, I'm in the high five! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are! High road to the high five for high times flow. That old Clark is that now. That old Clark is in our junior heavyweight top five. Oh boy, that's exciting. <laughs> that is exciting. exciting. Very exciting. And I, guys, I, I can't, can't like not think that tonight's been exciting so far. It's been pretty fucking rad. I will not project yeah. any emotions about the night. <laughs> so because that's that, I don't want to feed into them like, hey, maybe we should do this again next year. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm, yeah. I'm sure Pre Kurt is is figuring something out. It just would have been please. nice to have known ahead of time. That's yeah. all. Yeah, I mean, I'm not the big on last It's a rad week, idea. Maybe. No, I mean, clearly this is something. An let's be real. It. This is something that he's planning. Oh, 100 percent. Just because he. he oh. Well, yeah, because she outsmarted him, made sure that all of the all of the say had to go through her. Now he he gets to swoop in and act like the hero because the insurance didn't fall through. You don't have to be a dick. You know what I'm saying? Like this tournament is great because wrestling should come in all different styles for all different people. There should be something for everyone, like a sweet sampler platter. But mm. that doesn't mean you have to get rid of the deplorables for it. Well, uh, we're, we're heading back into the tournament. Yes, now. we are, and we're heading there with Hanzo and Fez. And I, I got to be honest, Fez, uh, getting getting not that much rest here coming to the second. I wonder why the oh big shock he, he uh, eliminating Golden Boy. Well, that makes yeah, that makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? Well, who's uh, riding this big dog? Come on, yeah, yeah. Uh, this is uh, going to be you can only disrupt his plans so far. <laughs> the exact opposite of stylings, but. As I stand right now, I mean, guys, Fez has been doing incredible work. Like, this has been... He was down in that match. Like, Yoraki was dominating the majority of the rounds there, and Fez, with this late run of suplexes and just barrage of forearms to the back of the head, Fez getting the win over Yoraki, not expected, in my, my own opinion, um... I, I would have I would have lost a lot of money if I bet on anything with Yoraki there, but uh, this one, Han I think Hanzo's in trouble. Maybe maybe considering he's he's one of the first guys that that fought tonight, he's got a lot <laughs> kind he of an upper hand on this one, Legend. Oh yeah, <laughs> Legend, <laughs> what? please be professional. HR's not even here tonight. I know. They I weren't, they weren't, so they weren't gonna come here because of the deathmatch tournament, but now it's a whole other fucking reason. Why. Everything kind of turned up, came out legend, didn't it? Yeah, indeed, indeed. Well, uh, do do you care to weigh in on this match of who's going to win? I love this. I feel like both of them kind of thwarted. While everyone here was invited into the tournament, both of them sort of thwarted Talon's plans. Obviously, Fez taking out Yuraki uh, is an obvious one, but you know he's been looking at Dave Karolinko pretty closely, and Hanzoman's like, oop, nope, pay attention. Yeah. He got the critical. Uh, or I'm sorry. Is as I did mention, he was criticaled yeah. a couple weeks ago and has come back. With something he, he to look, prove. He looks fine. He, he, he looks, looks great. great. He did awesome on Wednesday taking out Richard, who just mysteriously decided not to show up for tonight's tournament. Weird, right? It's funny how that happened, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'll st I, I will take Hanzoman. He, I, th if, I think if anyone is going to thwart Fez, Hanzoman will be able to find that way He's just so because unique. of that speed. Yes, yep. so he has very unique. We saw him do that cartwheel kick. That yeah, just, and the capoeira kick that, that ended the out, fight. Yeah, it so took out Karolinko in the first round. That was awesome. And I think coming laterally at this fight is how, is how he's going to beat Fez. Well, the, the height difference is not, uh, not going to be a factor here. Fez, uh, yeah. 
Fez is going to try to shoot in for those suplexes. This is going to be a fight indeed. Hanzo, Mon, and Fez, I think we are all ready to head into the second round of the Tournament of Steel. Let's head to the ring, guys. There we go. Much better. Watch the engines twist. <laughs> Both of these men uh, having long drawn out matches, but I gotta say that Hanzo's gonna be fresher. Uh, he's had some time to rest and Fez got his ass kicked for a lot of that first round. I just don't know, uh, don't know if he can close in on the weight advantage that Fez is gonna have. He's a true heavyweight, guys. Fez is 240. Built like a goddamn bowling ball. He's out here. He looks fine to me. Pissed off as ever. Got that towel on his head. Maybe he had time to take a quick shower, if anything. Wake himself up because he was in trouble quite a few times in that match. Got saved by the bell at one point, too. Hanzo is going to have to dance. <laughs> his life away avoiding those takedowns and he definitely took down oh, Fez on that one and secondary one as you see the placement of that kick that sold but a little mm. more high pro nice bip and a bop there by Fez and now straight up punching his temple Ooh. Ooh. interesting exit out of that kick knowing that he wasn't getting it and just trying to put distance between him with a cartwheel that's I I've seen it in momentum. fights before, but Capoeira, you don't necessarily see used in fighting a lot. It's true. Only the strong tend to use it. <laughs> oh, my God. It's going to cost him a lot of points if he keeps it up and just dishes it out willy-nilly. Okay, I'll stop with the pun. God, you son of a bitch. <laughs> He's hot. Leg trip there by Hanzo. He is trying to avoid the takedowns. Really? Oh, and he's gonna fail oh, there. there it is. There's one, and now just laying in those heavy forearm shots, trying to distance himself. Look at that, creating the distance with that Capoeira style. You know, again, it's so rare that you see that, but he's using it pretty well tonight. Well, it worked for him. He knocked out Dave. Oh, Turned no. him over. Oh. And slams him down. Dead center of the of. Thank you, dude. Thank you. You're welcome. Got but behind him, now playing those punches. His temple. Fez turning into it. Oh, beautiful armbar right there. Almost into a uh, triangle choke of some sort, but he's trying to extend, get that knee behind his head. Couldn't do it. Now just testing each other's steel. Fucking hell. The thud on that last one. Miss with the takedown attempt there. Oh, what was he going for there? But Fez put a stop to it. That is the end of round one. Gotta say, I think it was a close one, but I think Fez won that one on takedowns. Oh, trying him on that fucking flippy shit. Ooh. Wow. Oh, jeez. Telling him to bring it on straight yeah. ahead. Yeah. Now playing a little bit more uh, cordial here. Oh, my God. Well, that's and why he's he being careful. Right Oh, oh. oh boy! Oh, oh boy. now we're in a fucking fisticuff <laughs> fight here. If we could get a scoreboard above him, you'll just see the numbers climbing with each exchange of strikes. Oh, miss those two! Not gonna miss this. Oh my god! And then transitioning over to that choke. Whoa, whoa, what are we gonna see here? Another spine buster. Oh, beautiful pop of the hips into that suplex once again. Oh my god! You are seeing all-out domination on hand here by Fez. Hanzo opened him up, tried to finish him off with that cartwheel kick, but now, Jockey Ford goes for that kick to back him off. Fez now trying to create some distance, opening up with those shots. It's open hand slap. Oh, no. Ooh. Trips out the front, and now working over the back of the head. Shot there. Ooh, he's kicked to the back of the head. That was interesting. And now the strike off between these two four arms to fucking Demock. 
Whoa, he landed one of those in the fight with Kirilenko. He almost got a win with that kick in the first round. He got the win with a different styling of kick. I wonder if Fez uh, was watching along, but I don't... Oh, caught him through the kick. Popping those hips, too. Count. We are at the halfway of that tent, and he's back up. Missing both of those now. Hanzo quick with the feet. Oh, oh nice yeah. pick out. Kick to the back of the head. I think it missed. Maybe possibly saved by the bell in that round. Round three starts. Oh, that last one caught him square in the side of the face. Oh. Almost in the jaw. Oh, oh, fuck! Oh, oh, and a German suplex in the corner! Oh, to his feet. unforgiving corner! Oh, now again, going to that, uh, he, he's trying to keep him away from him. He can't get any, uh, any leverage during that positioning. Yeah. The shot there. Oh, 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 oh my god! Six second magic! Six second magic! <laughs> Almost getting the submission victory over there, but is that the last he had? to go come on Hanzo I'm not done seeing you wear that shit shoots him down to the ground beautiful transition to a knee bar again oh, a transition into the knee bar they're trapping him he's, it's like he's giving himself away the second that he takes the bait that's what he rolls yeah. through and captures yeah. Yeah. and now backing up yeah. Fez with those elbows Oh, got the kick. Oh, my God. Fez having trouble getting to his feet. Oh, my God. Hanzo Mon. Oh! Who the fuck could have seen that shit coming? Hanzo Mon. Hanzo fucking Mon. Well... Can I make a really interesting point? Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. Point, yeah. Not particularly. <laughs> Inaugural Dub 3 Tag Team Champions and former uh, tag team partners, Hanzaman and Shaolin, have, were really dominant in the tag division. Sort of parted ways, sort of went in different directions, Shaolin kind of floundered, Hanzo Man found new partnership with uh, Black Ninja, but now where they are, Shaolin ascending to Blood God of the Death Boys, and Shaolin moving up unexpectedly as the Dark Horse <laughs> in the Tournament of Steel, if, the exact opposite. If you lined up our entire roster and, and asked who you think is the toughest guy in that locker room, I'm going with one of the tradition members, probably. Uh, Fez is a good candidate, but I... Hanzo isn't the guy that jumps out to me, but clearly the man is trained. Well, Talon saw something, enough to invite him anyway. He, Yeah, he was one of the guys invited. One of these guys, uh, I don't think, had the invite, honestly. <laughs> hey, shut up. Was it you? Show your no. proof. Were you not one. invited? Yeah, I think, well, Burkowski, I think Richard Burkowski was supposed to be in this tournament, and I don't know what the hell happened. And he didn't I guess it. he should have showed up. Yeah, yes. he got lost. We all saw the footage. Yeah, he, I, he just zipped around that corner to... Oh, don't know where. He gets cold feet. He's not very good at commitment. I don't know if you know this. Yeah, no. pff, ask Bree. Am I right? She's not here. Don't <laughs> ask. Wait. I'll ask her later if she lets me. Bring up the brackets right here. Hanzo Mon into the finals of the Tournament of Steel. This is going to be... I feel like this might be the match of the tournament that we're about to witness right here. Hikaru Shizuoka and Kim Chi in the semifinals to determine who will face Hanzo Man in said finals. Okay, Kim Chi had a nice little brawl to begin with a uh, with Trucker at the at the uh, first round, but Shizuoka had a little bit easier time. He beat Dojo in the opening minute of the first round with what looked to be a, a heel hold. And uh, we still don't have word on Dojo's 
uh, his his injury. I, I it, there's no update there, but he tried to get up and fight, and it wasn't looking very good. Um, so H H Hikaru Shizuka is very well rested. Uh, barely took any shots in that fight. He's gonna take some here tonight. He's gonna take some with Kim Chi. He's the last remaining. I can't believe I'm saying this. He he's he is the traditions chance to win this whole tournament. You know, the tournament that Steel Talon set up for, let's be real, his boys to win. Fez knocked Yuraki well, in the first round. Surprise, surprise. His boys to shine, but also to, to in his warped and twisted way, showcased this style of wrestling. He invited people like Trucker. Trucker you wouldn't think of to be on Talon's uh, list of, of people to prove himself, but obviously he saw something there about, you know, reformation. Maybe he really does believe in Brick. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Richard. Richard. Richard Brickowski is the full name. But uh, as it stands right now, I'm going to... <laughs> I think the only one he doesn't want here is Kim Chi. And, uh, funny and therefore, enough, go Kim Chi. <laughs> that's who I am putting my money on. I think Kim Chi is going to sneak out a win here. Hikaru Shizuoka might be taking him lightly because I think... <laughs> I think he uh, thinks very highly of himself. Uh, it's pretty oh. easy to see that. Yeah, Dino, surprising, right? <laughs> All right, uh -huh. semi-finals to decide who is going to the finals to face Hanzo Man Shizuka, taking on Kimchi. Come on, Kim. Man who barely broke a sweat got in a good position to end the match and then went a step further did Hikaru Shizuoka as far as I'm concerned. This kid doesn't have respect for anyone but himself and I guess he has some respect for Steel Talon. Well, they have met in the ring before, too, on that four-on-four -four, uh, Chi Dynasty versus uh, Tradition at On the Horizon. But otherwise, in very different weight divisions. Yeah, the, the heaviest competitor in this tournament by far, Kim Chi, stepping in. That, yeah, but you're uh, shade number under one 300. contender for our World Heavyweight Championship. I mean, this guy has it going on. Can he get a win here to get through to the tournament finals? yet to be determined because Hikaru Shizuoka is a dangerous, dangerous human being. Oh yeah, he doesn't give a fuck. He has no fear. He doesn't have that, that, that part that holds you back with fear, so he just goes in. Speaking of going in, Kim Chi shooting in with two repeated knee strikes to the midsection where he keeps all of his bread again! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. You know what else has that trait? Big dog sociopaths. He's answering though. Those one-two shot combos, knees from Shizuka now, go behind, beautiful leg trip there, and oh my god, wrenching back on that face lock, but Kimchi able to pry his fingers apart, that's going to be the strength advantage and the size advantage of Kimchi. You also gotta think that Yoshiatsu and Shizuka spar a lot, so yeah. Shizuka has felt a lot of knees and, in his midsection, so. And to be fair, Nexus on top of that, Shizuka sparring with Hatsuyama, who is almost a carbon copy size-wise next to Kimchi. Oh, Both yeah. men right at that 6'6". Six, six. I think Hatsuyama is a shade uh, taller and right around the 300-pound mark. A little leaner. He's got hair, too. Cross arm breaker attempt, again, using the strength to pry his way out of it. He's also got a little butt hurt right now because oh, he didn't get to oh, see oh, the oh, oh, he's got the lock oh. <laughs> And again, just pushing the heels through, using his strength and size advantage. There's a uh, reason that MMA has weight classes, and you're going to see if Kim Chi can use that. But again, Shizuoka was the smaller man in the tournament in the first round, too, with Dojo. Hey, he doesn't give a fuck. Standing oh, choke there. The neck. I don't think he got it cinched in. Kim's just tall. He has to get him down on his level. Plus he's bald, it tends to get the secretion on the head a little uh, bit easier. It's interesting that you point that out. It's, 
That's pretty factual as far as I'm concerned. I, I can vouch I'm for that. I'm bald and I, I get sweaty. Oh my and god! Face. And speaking of which, seeing the mist of his fly as he gets his fucking face painted with those Whoa. snaps. The round is over. <laughs> Just as it was about to get a little beefy. He <laughs> had to stop himself from throwing a knee there. Oh, Maybe again, that arm bar is stuck him. in again. He's like a little spider monkey. Shot in, Kim. Denying it. Ooh, again, sidestepping it. Kim is... In, he's a quick motherfucker. Don't let the size fool you. There's a reason why he's the number one contender of the heavyweight division. Oh my god, sticking and moving, Kim Chi. Beautiful leg sweep. Oh, spinning back! That looked to be an open palm. Oh! Oh, yeah, get him when he's down, too. I love to see it. That's full contact right there. Oh, beautiful single leg trip there, forcing the shoulder into the uh, in, into the shin there, forcing his body backwards. That is, uh, you can't go anywhere. As you think he tried to do just the same. Sweeping the leg, knees now to the he's crown to the of the head. <laughs> well, he he's under instructions, big dog, not to let Kim Chi get past him if he got out of that first round. And with Yuraki being out, he has a lot to, on oh, his no. shoulders. Oh no! Oh no! 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 He hold applied, and he was able to kick him off of it. <laughs> as far as the approval oh. of the founder goes, and sh holy shit, Shizuka is. Oh yeah, you're profusely. seeing it. You're seeing it. I wonder what got him. Maybe one of those knees to the top of the head, the crown, as Dino said. That the skin is very thin. Did you just hear that? Oh He's my god! <laughs> He's laughing as he punches the back of a oh. fucking skull. Stomp to the midsection. Oh, he's got that hooked in. Elbows to the trapezius. And now those open palm strikes. Oh, my God. Shizuka, Shizuka takes me as someone who likes to bleed. Ooh. Hot. <laughs> Legend. What? I mean, it's oh, crazy. saved by the bell there. He had a uh, knee bar locked in. Great show. Sticks out his tongue, likes to bleed. Oh, oh. Tick, tick. Good God, he is unloading. Oh, more and more. Oh, no, 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 no. She's okay. That Watagame, he steps oh. right into the knee strikes to the crown. Look at that, he bridged out of it. What is this? What is this? What is he? He's waiting for him to get up. Oh, whoa, he's right into him. He's trapped him. God. Damn, Shizuka. Beautiful transition right into the triangle choke. Now, knees to the midsection. He had him locked. Oh, my God. Shizuka is up in this round big, and Kim Chi struggling to his feet. Count of four. Up the four. Picks the legs. And now, again, applying those knees right to the top of the head. Armbar locked in. Beautifully executed by Shizuka. This guy is... Everything that he's built up to be by Steel Talent. Beautiful takedown. And again into the heel hold. He's got to get out of that. Give up. Does successfully. Give up. He's got to survive this round. Oh! <laughs> what the fuck? Are you fucking kidding? A double no choke. That transition is one in a million. <laughs> If Dust Hype Trey needs a break dancer, maybe contact a car. <laughs> Master oh! CG honestly should be very proud of this one. It's insane. He I'm I'm very He's impressed. He's a hell of a trainer. Holy Oh, God. beautiful roll over into that front yeah. face lock choke. Backpedaling and he caught him with an arm bar. Yeah. Stepping right into it. Kim is in trouble. He's got eight seconds. No, excuse me. Oh, oh. Three seconds, I misspoke, and now round <laughs> four on. Game. This is what the is this the longest tournament match? Oh no, the first one went to five, I wanna say. Oh no, what has he got in mind here? Oh! Kim's up! Just take down God look oh, yeah, just um but he transitions into the ground! Oh! 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 <laughs> Twister locked in! No! I am full of shit. And now giving him a taste of his own elixir. That was take this. Oh, knees to the crowd! That is fuck. 
Beautiful well, takedown. Oh, oh, oh he shot him with the heel. Both of these men down. Oh, his fucking face. Guillotine choke once again. And he just doesn't have the doesn't have the pressure applied there. Oh, those elbows to the side of the face. The count oh, being administered him. by Dick him. O'Malley. Oh Come shit! On. Oh shit! Get up, Kim! Get up, Kim! Get up, Kim! Get up, Kim! No! Oh my god! Oh my god! Kim! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Yes! the final! The tradition is out of the tournament of stars. <laughs> That's gotta be one of my top Let's maybe fuck. two moments of the year. That was oh, history. Will remember this day, <laughs> no matter what happens. <sighs> Fourth oh round, three God. minutes, 20 seconds. The series of knee strikes <laughs> and then a kick to the ribs, taking every single bit of oxygen that Hikaru Shizuka had left out. Ten count. The standing, he was on his feet, but uh, Dick Patty, Patty O'Malley was very clear that he <laughs> was not full name every time. Was not going to let him continue. He was out on his feet. He still doesn't know where he is. Well, he's uh, in uh, Loserville right now. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Fucking got I him. I went there. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> hold Holy on, hold shit. on. I, were, I got this one really quick because I just, I really wanted to update this bracket. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> is he standing kids. right now? Bye, kids. Not in a million years would I have thought that that would be the main event of this tournament I didn't know was happening <laughs> like an hour and 45 minutes ago I bet he better hope that he really likes Hansomon yeah well he sent him an invitation so <laughs> yeah something in my he sent him an invitation <laughs> they're both here man you still got some work to do if you're tradition boys these are not tradition boys in the final and whatever <laughs> prize they're gonna get <laughs> uh, I hope you have a big smile on your face when you give it, because it's not to one of your kids. All right, our heavyweight fight for the fifth is set. Uh, it, before the tournament finals, we got the heavyweight heavyweight division that's going to be shaken up here. Or it's staying staying the exact same at uh, <laughs> the exact same way. I'm 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 losing my mind tonight. <laughs> you, you you were gone. You're broken. I'm losing my mind tonight. Legend Powder Keg. Quite impressive victory in that four-man eliminator this past Wednesday. Shogun is there now. He's in the top five. You know he is going to fight as hard as he humanly can bear tonight because Shogun is where he wants to be, and Shogun needs to get this win so he can just kind of slowly and painfully move up that divisional rankings. He knows what he has to do. I know he's capable of it, but he's got powder keg here. He's got to get through powder keg before he can do any of that. What's your take on it? Well, as you pointed out, the poster uh, with being Yoraki kicking Wu Fang in the face, Shogun and Talon have actually something very, very in common. Yeah. It's uh, that Wu Fang lives rent free in their heads. Oh, fuck. <laughs> whether you, whether you've got one up on them, Shogun has finally beaten him. Should have got that monkey off his back. Talon kicked him up, made a fool of him, left him lying, and still, still, he can't get him out of his head. He had to put him on the poster for this. This means a lot. Shogun getting a win here tonight could, I don't know if he would want to get the attention of Steel Talon, but if he hates Wu Fang that much, that might be something he would consider. If, you know, depends how far your hate can drive you, big dog. Yeah. Who's to say? Drove executioner to the World to Heavyweight the world, Championship. To the World Heavyweight Championship, and he is doing just fine. Shogun wants that World Heavyweight Championship, too. He's got a long way. Dino, powder keg first there to uh, to try to derail Shogun's quest for gold. How do you think uh, Shogun fares in this heavyweight fight for the fifth? Well, this is definitely a battle of the different types of beasts on yes. this one. Shogun uh, relying on those those axe kicks and that Gonzo bomb just completely disgusting. But then you have Powder Keg 
in his beautiful explosion known as the powder bomb. Uh, I uh, <laughs> This is something that I would watch on the tapes, man. I, I'm loving the flavor of this uh, matchup coming up. But as far as the journey for gold on Shogun is, he's got a pretty big fucking uh, bump in the road mm-hmm. in the shape of a powder keg. So, uh, uh, honestly, I'm favored a little more towards powder. Ooh, okay. Ooh. Saucy. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, we've seen Powder Keg uh, assert his dominance many times before. He is the former champion in this match. <laughs> so, Nexus, Omega, Taken. Uh, we're going we're gonna to round out the table with you. We're getting everyone in on this uh, fight for the fifth. Who you got? Well, first of all, happy 4th of July EST, everyone. Um, second of all, you know, we say it every Saturday that the number five spot is the hardest working spot in dub three in the rankings for sure and yes you have a new competitor every saturday whoever wins that eliminator it's really exciting can powder keg make it well the top four are established in the heavyweight division and shogun can't seem to be established in the heavyweight division he gets close but no cigar this is a huge test for shogun because i frankly am sick of him constantly dropping the ball when he's in this position powder keg with the wonderful Gloria, are here to take that spot from you, Shogun. Stop thinking about Wu Fang. Have your eyes on Sumo Joe, who's sitting in that number four spot right Crazy. now. If you want to make a name for yourself in W3, you ought to start moving up in this division. Yep. you got to blast through Powder Keg and do it tonight. Or I'm getting sick of you. All right, the heavyweight fight for the fifth all lined up. Powder Keg challenging Shogun for that fifth spot in the heavyweight division. Let's head to the ring. I think we're going to see a little bit of the same that we've been seeing here tonight. This is going to be a fucking on. fight. Ooh. Spread it on. On thick. Hey, Gloria. Speaking of thick, Gloria. <laughs> How did he get into this building? <laughs> you know, the more I hear that song, the more I think it's a love letter to you, Big Dog. Oh, well, thank you. I appreciate it. He didn't write the song. Who did? Uh, you know what? I think it was French uh, Canadian Stewart? country singer Dion Tubbs. Oh, so, oh, oh. well. Wow. Interesting. Very popular. Ooh. Let's see back to the yeah. I feel like uh, this man on the right defending the fifth spot would fare pretty well in the Tournament of Steel. Uh, it's kind of right up his alley here. The kicks and the, the elbows... I'm wondering if he's watching in the back. Uh, oh my god! He's trying in this oh. early powder bomb! Early! <laughs> Just like silently approving. Yeah. Like I can get with this shit. Oh, and he is making him pay for that. Cool water kicks. Just hitting you like a hard splash in the face. Headbutt Speaking there of, by powder. Yeah, yeah like... Jesus. Step over cross lock applied there. He's sitting all that 300 plus back on the lower lumbar region. Leg trip beautifully done by Powder Keg. Chop to the chest. Body slam. Taking off of the head of steam, but Shogun right to his feet. And then foot to the face in fucking succession there for Shogun. <laughs> Let it out! Oh, Go for the cover! Off into the ropes, shoulder tackle, taking the big man down, but he is right there, able to capitalize on the sloppy ring positioning. Oh boy. Bow and arrow locked there. Robin Charleston administering the count. Gloria, hogging up all the spotlight over there. I see you, girl. (laughs) Back and forth, punch to chops, and that big right overhanded hook lands flush on the jaw of Shogun. Shogun looking to end it. Oh, all that weight. 
was a big dog. You're caught talking about her hogging the spotlight. When you got all hands of stone out there shouting at you at the top of her lungs to get your ass up and keep fighting. Whoa. <laughs> That's sometimes all the inspiration Whoa. you need. Hopper King's a hell of a fighter and he's got Gloria. <laughs> Keeping him going. Oh man, every which way into the apron now. <laughs> Had his way with him on the outside there, and a bear hug. Kind of got stuck in that corner. Murder corner. Murder corner. Well, that's actually Whoa. the exact opposite corner. <laughs> <laughs> got a Kentucky compactor. Two, no. Where Major Tom was birthed <laughs> into table saw Tommy. It's true. Dino, the rapid successions of those kicks that you're seeing, <laughs> just to the forehead of Powder Gig. It's gotta be yeah, doing damage. They are, uh, <laughs> there's something to, to not blink at because you don't want to miss every single hit. Oh, a bit oh, spicy. Fucking shit, you see? Oh! Oh, he's got him up! Got the go to knee now, going for the cover, trying to end this one now. 2.9 powder keg on the ropes here, literally oh. and figuratively. Oof. Oof. Oh. Oh. Measuring that second strike. Oh, oh, <laughs> you do not. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. The world. Spread it the oh. fuck on. Spread it on. You go around the world with Gloria. You deserve to. God damn. Oh my god. God, I don't think he was planning to get the shit power bombed from <laughs> his soul. <laughs> oh, it's the clean up on that side of the ring. Ooh, and boy. now, <laughs> Good an night. another loss for Shogun. Ah, uh, see? Like that. And the last thoughts he had before those lights were turned out was, I wonder what Wu Fei's doing. No, don't, no, don't say that. That's a little mean. <laughs> I know, okay, you're right, you're right. He would probably kick me in the face. <laughs> he heard that. But luckily, he's sleeping. Night, children. You know what? I, I I'm far more invested in making in making sure to uh, keep Talon's day going as badly as possible. He took our deathmatch tournament from us. Let's take his joy from him because right now you see as we move into the finals of the <laughs> tournament of Steel, <laughs> yeah. Kim Kimchi has done his part. You could kind of make the argument took out two tradition members. <laughs> Yeah, a little bit, yeah. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> oh, okay. Yep, I'm catching you guys. <laughs> and Hans Oman, who's, oh my god, just hella impressive. Hanzo, not the guy that you're expecting coming into the finals. And Kim Chi, not somebody that I think was invited to this tournament. How dare you? He has a ticket. Uh... <sighs> He had a ticket. I don't know what you're talking about, big dog. I think Richard Burkowski might have been uh, in this tournament, <laughs> but lost. he's gone. He's lost. He got he's cold gone. feet. This is also probably the largest size discrepancy in the tournament. Hanzo Mon, about 180. Kim Chi closing in on 300. This is an uphill battle for Hanzo. That being said, in the second round, he put down a heavyweight in Fez. With a uh, with a kick right to the side of that. In fact, he put out Karolinko with a kick to the side of the head. Maybe we should start talking about Hanzo Mon's kick. I think we should talk about Hanzo Mon. Full Le stop. Legend, go ahead, <laughs> go ahead. Wh who, who do you got in this one? You're really seeming to like Hanzo coming in here. I did, and <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> as if this would be the the most intriguing versus the one that would piss off Talon the most. I. I, I gotta stick with the Chi Dynasty in this. They have to drive their own destiny here. It, it would be amazing to see Hanzo Mon pull this off. The, the, this kind of victory with the parallel that I talked about earlier with Shaolin, the Blood God. That, that's fucking poetry right there. And yes, I am a is. sucker for something that romantic. But, oh, I do really like getting Talon's goat. <laughs> um, Kim Chi. Kim Chi in the finals for Legend. Dino Winwood, Hanzo Man, and Kim Chi in your finals. If you had to put money on it, who fucking you got? no! Don't don't give me that option, um, because <laughs> I'll lose I'll lose money regardless. Uh, this is 
you got stupid sexy Hanzo Mon. And you got Kimchi, a man who uh yeah, almost didn't make it to the tournament despite being invited from the get go. Uh they have basically defied the odds set against them and uh, predetermined against them. Let's be let's be honest here, let's call it what it is. Uh this this entire tournament has been completely unpredictable. I have never been so unsure of my predictions or decisions in my life more than I have tonight. And honestly, I don't see any difference in that pattern because these two have proven that one one is on one hand the person is <laughs> made for this tournament. Yes. And on the other hand, the second one showing a whole new leaf and a whole new wrinkle in his trousers. Um God, so yeah. this is going to be an unpredictable finals and honestly i just want to be happy in the surprise of who comes out the winner of this tournament of steel just like our lovely fans tonight regardless of my inappropriate comments towards hanzo man uh, he has impressed me regardless of who wins this match i'm leaning towards kim chi the fact that he got invited guys and he took out Shizoka. Just thinking about Kim Chi here, thinking about the fact that this is called the Tournament of Steel, thinking about the fact that he's been playing chess, he's taken out Hikaru Shizoka, he's taken out Sumo Joe, and he's now plundering down the rankings. To win this tournament, I don't know what part of chess this would be, I don't know if this would be taking the queen, I don't know how highly that he rates... How, how highly Talon rates this tournament and had that big stupid brain of his. But to have Kim Chi win it, and just to see Talon have to congratulate him, would just be the most beautiful thing. And I love beauty, big dog. So I'm going with Kim Chi. Oh, all right. We are all set for the Tournament of Steel Finals. Not what we were expecting here tonight, but it's what we're getting. Hanzo Man and Kim Chi. Let's head to the ring for the finals. Big fight feel here tonight. Ooh. A lot Size of leg muscles. Size difference, weight difference, all of this. In Kim Chi's favor, but Hanzo, God, and he hasn't had an easy, neither of these guys have had an easy way through this tournament. Both previous matches, hellish for both of these competitors. Regardless, like I said, who wins this? Hanzo happens to win or lose. This is a different Hanzo Mon, and I will not think of him as the same Hanzo that went into this tournament of the you know. Regardless of how this match ends, you are without a doubt correct on that Nexus. Carries himself with a lot of pride, a lot of arrogance a lot of people have said, but for good reason. This guy is taking it to Talon the only way he knows how. Straight line. Yes. The oh, time for chess is over. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> Already off to a striking Already at the temple. Oh my god, this is going to be a knockout in the first round. I'm feeling oh my it. God. Somebody is getting it. I'm not saying I was expecting them to bump gloves at the beginning, but that was pretty great. No. Oh, <laughs> got it locked in. That foot yeah. is behind him. No. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Shot to the midsection there. Both checking kicks there, and uh, I, I want to say a Shot got through all those all got through. Yeah, that was a couple of shots that got through. <laughs> oh, Kim now trying to use that distance. Beautiful leg trip there. And now the knees of Kim Chi reigning in. But he's quick to his feet out from under the six foot six, 300 pound Kim Chi. Uh, trying to add some self coloring highlights to those beautiful gold locks of Hanzo Man. Which, we by the way, never expect him to be a blonde. Oh, no. I, I, he's every once in a while I you'll see it feeling. hanging out, hanging out of the back of his mask. But yeah, now, I, I think transitioning to that match, so we can breathe in a in a fighting Ooh. climate here. 
knee right to the face. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, no. He tried to bring him into his guard, but Kim able to shift his weight away from it. And again. Oh. He's got to keep... Not, <sighs> not backing away. He's not. Again, you're seeing that applied again he just to had. keep... As, as, the inaugural, as one half of the inaugural oh. tag champs, Hanzo Mon is used to facing much larger opponents. And with, Look and at with that. Black Ninja as well. They've taken on BBA. They've taken on the Uprising. And they've taken on the Chi Dynasty before. Many times. Oh, yeah. missing yes. all of those uh, all of those straights and hooks there to end the, uh, excuse me, end the round. Pulling him into guard once again. And again, not paying off. Kim Chi just using his brute strength. Escape there, pulling through the legs there. Soccer oh. kick once again. Clearly those are legal in this tournament. <laughs> now trying to stay away from Kim, probably for the best there. Again, now right into that hold. I just don't know how much that, uh, how much pressure that applies. I know that that applies oh. pressure. <laughs> On the other hand. Oh, knee to the face. Jesus. Whoa, I thought he was going over. Oh. Punches to the back of that eye. Whoa, I did that arm bar. No. Again, just, sh just pushing him by the heel off of his arm, alleviating that pressure. I guess Hanzo thinks he can out... I, I, I guess out clinch and out work... Kim on the ground, which, you know what? That might be all oh, beautiful transition. Ooh! Oh. Trying to use a little bit of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu here. Trying to keep away from the striking prowess of Kim Chi. Shot to the face. Round two, ending with a bang. Beautiful transition into the cross arm breaker. It's a large man going up for that. <laughs> mm. Transition by Kim Chi. Oh! oh God, I hate those. I hate looking at those because they look so fucking painful. I guarantee you they're painful. I don't fuck with, man. He oh, dropped God. him. Maybe saved by the bell there. Blue Shoes didn't call for a count. Woo! He is starting this round off proper and now teeing off on the back of Kim Chi's head. Still defending. Not gonna get a stoppage there. Oh! Shit. Ooh, a calf slicer. We saw this used by Shizuoka earlier. Armbar transition right into it. He's got the full extension. Kim just using his strength. Oh. Nice. Right on the chin, and now just wrapping that, constricting around that leg. Trying to pop the knee out of place. <laughs> At the same time, oh. getting the calf muscle off of the bone. Oh, oh, oh my god! god. Another one following up. It's starting to get fucking hot in her. <laughs> now grinding that, that uh, shin into the neck, trying to... Get an armbar and a choke submission there. Oh my oh, god. He stepped into it. He stepped into it. I think he was trying to go underneath it and he oh, got he caught. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hanzo! Oh no! Hanzo got caught! Hanzo got caught! The winner of the tournament! Those <laughs> He ducked into it and got caught! Oh my god! Those Fucking kicks or something else. One misstep. As Delible pointed out from the crowd, one misstep is yep. all it took. He ducked into the kick. Kim Chi lands it on the beak. And Kim Chi, the winner of the Tournament of Steel. Hold on. I, I was under the impression that there would be some kind of prize. What is he yeah. get, like gonna have like a medal or I, I, oh, well, what if it's a cash oh, prize? I don't know if there's a prize now. I'm gonna be completely honest. No, no, no. Rules are rules. You heard them. I don't know if there's gonna be a prize now. I have a I have a sneaking suspicion. We want a prize. We want a prize. I, I just want to see Talon look 
kick him in the face and say congratulations. That's what I want to see tonight. Hey, I mean, Kim's he's staying out here. He wants a prize. He's, he's saying, come bring me whatever, what the, the money, whatever, his stupid well, medal. He probably had a medal made with, like, Town's face on uh, it. Yeah, just a big chin. Or... Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, hold on. Are we going? Oh, I think so. We I'm got hearing word? a sound cue. Holy shit. Oh, Christ. How fucking long do you think How? it's going to get the oh. <laughs> I'm not sure, but this... Whoa, it, right, swing look at this. This is the fucking Ooh. end game, folks. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> this... The in-ring debut of a man who we thought was retired, and I guess coming out of retirement for his own tournament. Yeah, I'm sorry. Can we talk about the history here? <laughs> Seal Talon driving his yeah. father out of business? Yeah. I think this is the... The absolute prize that Kim would want. Um, this is uh, a happening. Uh, I, I guess we gotta call this distancing using his height and his size. They're distancing himself away from Steel Talon. Those shots Fucking getting in though. Oh. Those shots, man. Back and forth now, trying to close the gap. They're able to do so with that elbow drop, Steel Talon. Kim has had to face an entire plethora. This is his third, fourth match of the night. Guys, I'm shocked. I, I don't <laughs> even know what to say right now. Kim Chi just went through Mac Tucker, Shizoka, Hanzaman, and now he has to face Steel Talon. Kim Chi gets to do what his fucking family oh my has God, wanted look at this. to do for look months at this. and look get his hands I, on Steel Talon. I can't believe it. Exactly. I don't think happening. fear runs through this motherfucker's veins. No. Sidestep so that last slap. Cuz got suspended. For this putting his hands problem. on him. This is for cuz, this is for dad. Oh, soccer ball oh, kick once again. Talent right to his feet. This old oh. bastard is fast. Oh my god. Ooh, suplex. Kim again taking a step back. I don't think he was expecting Steel Talon to be this limber at his age. Oh. Well, again, he's fought three fights. F three fights. <laughs> I can count for a second. Round oh two. Ooh, oh. win for that that famous high enziguri kicked him in the. I'm gonna say he there. has not lost a step. No, this he has been working. I don't know if this has uh, been in the books for a long time, but it seems to be. Oh my god! Oh my god! What? Leg trip there. Oh, got caught with a heel. Talon right to his feet now, trying to distance himself. Beautiful transition. Look at that! Holy fucking shit! How old is he again? 51 years old. He's still relatively young, but, I mean, the guy had a hard career. Guys, looking at his movements, oh, you oh, 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 got it! He's to his feet! right back up. Oh, oh, I, can't help but feel, I can't help but feel like Talon's been training with his boys, too. It can't just be Fuji. There's no way he's in that good of shape. He's Once moving. Incredible. Right? Oh, 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 my God. Oh, oh my God. He's hacking him. <laughs> hey, and I've never seen him do that. Honestly, I've never seen I've never him do seen that. anyone do that. Who has done that? Ever. Bad. Kick there. Bad oh, man. no. Oh. <laughs> Just 
quit it. <laughs> Get the fuck away from me. Shot there by Talon. Stomp to the midsection. He's going for that low kick. He's trying to take away Kim's legs. But Kim, I think Kim's a little confused here, man. I'm confused. Oh, now, now, on to the shots of the back of the head. Kim laughing, getting the chance here. Oh my god, that's gotta feel so damn good. What is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, 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 oh my god! <laughs> what? Yeah, that's a way to end the round. That? Both men down on their backs there. Come on, Kim, beat, beat the shit out of him! Do it, come Doing on! in suplex there by Talon. Three rounds of this. Stomp to the midsection once again. Ooh. Sticking and moving. But he got caught. Axe kick me. Get up, G. Get up, Kim. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Kick him in the head. Back and forth with these two. Now, Kim trying to get some semblance of control. But there we go. Yeah, tee off on him. Overhand right, but he's blocking every single one of those. Able to slap him off, stomp to the midsection. He is he is moving so damn well in this match. Kick right to the shin. Oh, God. Oh, no. and traps him down. Ooh! He has the arm right behind his head. Come on, Kim. Oh, God, he got caught again. Kick right to the face. Kim slow to get up, as you could imagine, this fourth fight of the night. Almost superhuman-esque performance by the head of the Chi Dynasty. Oh my god. He's a badass. Oh! He's limits. Look at how far back he has that bulldog choke wrenched. And again going into it. Oh god. Kim trying to find a way out. Here we go. Kicks to slaps. He's... Hitting twice there. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Come on, get up, Kim. Come on, get up, Kim. Get up, get up. Oh my god. Come on, Kim. Come on, stand up. Oh, he is hurting. This is not good. That one uh, rattled the old equilibrium. Oh! Oh no. Oh, look at that face lock. Oh, God save. That, yeah. The bell is his friend. Four rounds. Round especially. Got the leg trip. There we go, Kim. Well, I mean, Kim with the knees. <laughs> Ooh. No Ooh. transition there by Kim. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, blasted him. That's what he caught. That's what he caught Hanzo with in the in the finals. I, I guess the finals. What is this? This is... Prize Fucking is winning the epilogue finals, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> the boss fight, literally. Oh my god, Talon's down! Boss. Talon's down! Talon, Talon, stay down! Oh stay god. down! Stay, actually, no, get up! Again. Oh my oh, god, god. He's, he's not gonna, gonna make it! No! Oh, oh, oh fuck! Fuck! So I close! Can do it, big bro. Both of these Shoot men tiptoed. Oh god! Let's say they have tiptoed at the edge of defeat in this oh. matchup in the feet. But that remains to be seen. Let's continue. Oh! He's got him down. Oh, oh knee strike. But he's right back up. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh my oh, god. Kim Chi's done it. He's down. Four. Five. Oh, he's not going to make it to his feet. He's not going to make it. Eight, oh my god. Nine. Oh, oh my god. god. God damn it. If this was an arcade game, he'd be flickering red at this. Oh! He's up! He's up! This was all for him. This was all for this him. was all for this him. This was a dick flex. Yeah. This is That's all it was. Guys, Kim Chi just went f almost fucking full four rounds with Steel Talon, who was fresh and obviously has not missed a day in the training facility. After it's already three big fights, this is not a loss. This is the Chi Dynasty pissing right on the tradition. 
I don't think I don't think Kim Chi gave up. I think that that choke was locked in well enough. I Jesus. I Come wait. On. Look, look at this wait. smug face. We're, I just got word from Kyle. We got someone in the back. We have a word. Yeah, we have a word. The night, old man. You might have taken the night, but you have lost the war here. We are gonna have a great American thrash. It is guaranteed this Friday. That's, oh, that's, that's your birthday. birthday. <laughs> wow. Fuck, yes. Nice. Well, that, that all fun. worked out nicely. Fuck yes. July 9th. Mark it on your calendars. This. I told next you to trust Friday. Me. Trust the process. Trust Bree Kurt. An unknown coming up. Clutch. We're heading to Mexico. I know. Did baby. say he wanted to invest. <laughs> Arena <laughs> Mexico next Friday, but we're gonna have a Wednesday show before that. We are. What's gonna happen in there? We uh, there's I, a fallout from this. Kim Chi made it, to, it. It won the tournament of steel, and his his winnings was fighting steel talent. And you know what? The first of in several. Defeat. Who I'm sure won their hands in, on talent. In defeat. I'm sure Kim got something from that. I don't think this is over. Steel Talon, you may have just uncorked an entire cask of Chi Vengeance. Somehow, somehow the Great American Thrash got hijacked and the knights still belong to the Chi Dynasty. Oh. You know <laughs> I'm beginning to think that Brick maybe didn't get lost. Yeah, something's <laughs> telling me. Weird.